Hey, what's up? This is St. Joe, MachineTutorials.com. Just want to do a quick video showing you how to install the machine expansion packs. I'm getting a lot of questions on these, especially when you have to download the multiple files or maybe somebody like on PC, if you just download the EXE from the email that you get and you don't download the ISO, then it errors out on you and everything like that. So you got to make sure if you're doing it on Windows, you need to download the EXE and the ISO file. Now on Mac, you just get the ISO and you can mount the ISO and install it that way on PC if you have both of these in the same location it will automatically create a virtual DVD drive for you so you just make sure you have both of these the exe and the ISO file this is the actual content the exe is actually the installer that runs and creates a virtual drive for you so you just double click on that click run then it's telling you what 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 I need to have and you can just go through and install it wherever you want I have my own location that I like to install my Native Instruments stuff. And then that's pretty much it. Like I said, you just want to make sure that you have both the ISO and the EXE if you're on Windows. And then on Mac, you just want to mount that ISO and then go ahead and, and run it. So it's pretty straightforward. But like I said, I get a lot of questions on it. Once you install it, you should be good to go. Of course, you have to actually run the service center to activate it. But once you do that, you're good to go. So. All right, so it's finished. Now if I start up machine, we'll see that it, it will go ahead and add the content for the expansion. That's how you know it's installed properly because machine will automatically read it no matter where you install it at in your system. I didn't I didn't install this on my system drive. I actually have a separate drive for my native instrument stuff and and my other plugins and all that. So, it doesn't matter where you install it. Machine will pick it up once you run the installer. So, of course, once it's done, it's going to tell you the new content has been installed and please activate it via service center. And if you go in here, we can see that we have there's drop squad and all the stuff for it. So, got the stuff there. You got the instruments, you got the kits, you got the plug-in presets for under massive there it is right there so all that stuff is there and of course if I go and I try to load say if I try to load one of these kits it's gonna tell me I need to actually activate it so just open service center put in your serial number activate it and you're good to go so if you got any questions let me know this is St. Joe machine tutorials com just showing you real quick how to actually install the machine expansion so see y'all later peace